what is your turnover of young people who are volunteers? They usually stay with us until they get a marvellous job elsewhere. So, for instance, John, uh, Mike's been with us for over a year. Uh, Abby, how long have you been with us now, Abby? Nearly a year. Nearly a year. We don't expect them to, you know, want to stay with us forever. We don't, we don't want to put any pressure on volunteers. They're really here in their own free time um, to do it, at, you know, as and when they can. I think that a volunteer needs to to maybe know why they're doing it and where they want to go with stuff. Um, for instance, uh, one of the girls worked, stayed with us, worked with us, uh, and took that experience to put onto her CV to, to take off to Africa. Uh, we've got another girl that put the experience on her CV and, and took that off to New Zealand. If you've got lots of similar qualifications to somebody else, or four or five people are applying for a job, if you've got volunteering down in your CV, it makes you stand on it and makes people look at that. Yeah. And also, if you've given it your time for free as well, people just think it's fantastic. It shows you've been passionate, doesn't Absolutely. it? Absolutely, mm -hmm. yeah. It's, it's rare that we'll often take full paid staff members and senior staff members from off the street. They're usually volunteers who have um, turned 18 and are eligible for staff. And we've seen as, you know, they've been with Snappy for a while, they've shown themselves to be fantastic volunteers. And they've shown themselves, they've shown that they can take responsibility and take initiative and we sort of promote them up through um, volunteers to staff. Where would your organisation be without volunteers? We wouldn't have one, to be fair. Um, volunteers make up the bulk of our of, of the members of, of Snappy basically. You know, we quite often will have more volunteers than children in. For us, that's a good day because it means there's, you know, one-on-one -on -one care. The, the whole organisation works on volunteers. I volunteer. And uh, without that help of volunteers, the staff would be overrun and the kids wouldn't be able to get the, you know, the attention they needed. Um, and Sappy just wouldn't work, basically. It's all about the people that you can help and all the opportunities you can get from it because even though it may start out as volunteering, it could progress to something more and you can get a lot of opportunities, which I've got a lot of opportunities from volunteering. I could write on my CV that I've sat on my ass for the last eight months, but it's, well, better, to, it's better to say, <laughs> well, I've filled my time doing volunteering and all sorts of various things. Don't just like think about it, you should, you should just make the leap and actually do it. What does volunteering mean to you? It's good fun, but it usually depends on what you're interested in. It means getting an opportunity to do things that I ordinarily wouldn't do. It's not what I thought it would be. It's not having to cope with a load of like messy kids and that. You get loads of satisfaction from it and you feel like you're not wasting your time. You know, it's like a, an extra family, if you like. I'd like, I'd like to volunteer pretty much for the rest of my life.